Welcome back to part 4 everyone. I'm going to try to keep this as short as possible so let's jump right back in where we were before. Uh, first off we're going to extract our encrypted key vault. To do this we just need to type... Uh, I'm going to go very slowly in the instructions because I, I don't know if you can actually read what I'm typing. But uh, we need to type NAND PRO ORIG1.BIN This is because ORIG1 was our good dump colon hyphen r16 because we're using a 16 megabyte image and we're reading from it raw kv bin i name it raw kv just to keep it in step with the text based tutorial to make for easy easier reference for you one space one and just hit enter here now we'll extract our config block so we'll just type nand pro orig one dot bin colon hyphen r16 raw config oops raw config dot bin 3de space 2 like I said all the commands will be in the description if you can't read these uh, and then of course press enter now we've got all the required information extracted we need to inject it into our XBR image to do this we just need to type NAND pro XBR dot bin colon hyphen w16 raw kv dot bin one one press enter you'll probably get a lot more terminal feedback than i am here because i'm just using examples for you next we'll write our config block so nand pro xbr dot bin colon hyphen w16 raw config dot bin the file we just wrote a few moments ago and 3de to hit enter. Finally, with our XBR image prepared, we can flash it back to our console. So we just type NAND Pro LPT colon uh, hyphen W16 and the name of our XBR image, XBR.bin, and hit enter. Now that XBR image is flashing to your console, nothing's going to happen here, of course, because I don't have an LPT port. But assuming you follow the instructions correctly, you should now have a JTAG Dex Box 360. Once the flashing is completed, just uh, turn your console off, disconnect uh, the LPT cables, you can remove them if you want, but leave the diodes in place and the jumper. Then turn your Xbox back on, and you should be greeted by your dashboard. If so, then congratulations guys, you've done it. I can't wait to see what hacks or mods you can come up with, and of course feel free to post your video response to my tutorials whenever you like, they'll all be accepted. Thank you very much for watching, I hope you found this useful, um, and I'll see you next time.